I'm Beatrice Zhang, and I'll be reading from my essay entitled Emigrants. Chinese American, a millimeter of space separates the two on paper, but I still have to travel 16 hours to get from one country to the other. Beijing was my mother's house. Today, it is a global city crowded with skyscrapers and apartment complexes to house its dense population. She knew Beijing in the 1960s and 70s. Mao Zedong was in office leading communist China. A picture of him hung on the wall of her apartment. Supplies were rationed with tickets given annually. Oil, cloth, meat. Wheat. At school, my mother was assigned to collect horse scat on the street for manure. Nothing was wasted back then. The first time I saw a dead man was in China the summer before my freshman year of high school. My aunt drove the car while I sat in the back seat, leaning my head against the window. I woke up from my nap just in time to see the show. A broken body on an orange dirt road, skull crushed by the tires of a car. Red blood next to redder flower petals scattered on the dirt. A crowd, motionless and emotionless. Small shops lining the side of the road. The sun, the only source of light. The car drives past the body slowly. They say it's faster to travel east. The earth pulls China away from me as it rotates itself at a thousand miles an hour when I'm floating above the Pacific Ocean in an airplane going west. 